Riding ATVs and UTVs can be a fun way to enjoy nature, but we need to make sure that we are dressed appropriately to be safe. To start with, we need to make sure that we are wearing boots to protect our feet and ankles. Often ATV riders think that a simple pair of gym shoes will be fine. However, wearing them while doing some heavy riding is an absolute no-no. ATV riders actually use their legs and feet quite a bit to control weight distribution while taking turns or going up and down hills. For that reason, you want to have boots that provide ankle and foot support and that ride up high enough to prevent potential burns from the engine and exhaust. Next, we want to make sure we wear a good long sleeve shirt and pants. This will help protect our skin in the event we fall off the ATV, as well as helping protect our skin from sticks, brush, or rocks that may brush against us or be kicked up from the trail. We wear gloves to protect our hands from flying gravel and rocks. They also protect your hands from bushes and branches as you drive past large trees, which can happen a lot. Gloves can also protect your hands from getting sore or blistered from rubbing and squeezing the handles as well as absorbing a lot of the vibration from the engine. Goggles or a face shield will help protect your eyes from tiny and large obstacles that may be flying in the air like dust, dirt, mud, rocks, bugs, sticks, and branches. Lastly, a perfect fitting helmet is necessary to protect your head. Helmets should fit snug, yet com be comfortable to wear. You should not be able to easily insert a finger between your forehead and your helmet lining, and the padding of a full face helmet should press lightly against your cheeks. With the helmet in place, try to rotate it without turning your head. If the helmet turns significantly on your head, Especially if it turns enough to interfere with your vision, it is too loose, and you should try the next size down. If the next size down is too tight, consider trying another brand, as each helmet manufacturer has fairly unique shell shapes. Without tightening the chin strap, shake your head briskly from left to right a few times. The helmet should follow your head and not come out of place. Same goes if you move your head up and down quickly. Now try the retention strap system. You should be able to easily strap on the helmet you choose. Once this strap is snug, grab the helmet with both hands and move it around vigorously. Your head should be moving with the helmet. If you're going to be wearing glasses with your helmet, make sure that you try them on at this time as well. You may need a slightly looser fit so your glasses are not pinched. Many people make the mistake of getting a helmet that is too large, especially when buying youth size helmets. However, a proper fit does not only make the helmet more comfortable to wear for extended periods, but it is also the best way to maximize protection. If the helmet is too large, the helmet may not be able to protect your head in an accident. Be a smart ATV operator and wear the right gear for a safe ride.